Time now for Sid 6 0. This is where I got 60 seconds to talk. Start the clock, please. Here's what's on my mind this morning. Maple Leafs spend a lot of money on their big names. The problem on the back end is that occasionally, because of the NHL salary cap, you might not be able to afford to keep other players. Take, for instance, Zach Hyman, fan favorite. Summer 2021, unrestricted free agent, and as a first line player with Toronto, he wanted to be paid. The Leafs didn't pay him. Hyman signed with Edmonton and won two playoff series last summer. Same deal. The Leafs like Jack Campbell last year, but not at $5 million a year. He also went to Edmonton. I know he's struggling, but cost was an issue. Let me introduce you to the next guy Toronto probably won't be able to afford. Michael Bunting. Entering play last night, he had nine goals in his last ten. He's on the first line. He's making virtually no money. And, oh, yeah, he's going to be an unrestricted free agent this summer. Paying your core four players is nice, but expensive, and it comes at a cost. Nick Kiprios of Sportsnet 590, the fan, real Kipper and born. Listen to it three to five daily on the fan. Kipper, great to see you. What is the price on bunting, do you think, this summer? He's at $950,000 this year. That's no money for an NHL player. I know it is for a lot of people, not for an NHLer. What do you think the number's going to be, bud? Market value, uh, said it would be closer to five million dollars so uh does he want to uh, try to earn as much as he can and that's what hyman did and unfortunately for lee fans they saw a very good player leave because he was always leaning towards what is the marketplace telling me and for hyman it was over five million dollars lee fans screamed it was crazy to pay him that and right now it looks like very good value for the edmonton oilers bunting his market value at over 50 points, if he finishes just under 60 like he did the year before, that market value is between 4.5 and $5 million. Will he ask for it out of the Toronto Maple Leafs or will he cut him some uh, s- some slack because he loves it here and he's a, he's a local kid? Uh, that r- remains to be seen. Let, let's talk about the cutting of slack here because Mark Giordano just did that this past offseason, signing... A, yeah. a dirt cheap contract to help out GM Kyle Dubas. Scarborough kid is Michael Bunting, as you're alluding to, Kipper. It, are we going to see this maybe a little more with the Leafs? Because we've never, no. said, like, Marner didn't take a hometown discount. No. Matthews was never taking a hometown. Like, are, is, is, are we seeing a shift here in the dynamic in the room, do you think? No. Okay. No, we're, we're not. And, and you cannot, those are apples to oranges when you could compare the Giordano's and the Jason Spezza's who will, who virtually play for free when, when you factor in the escrow that they're paying and the taxes and the cost of living. I'm telling you, there's not much <laughs> left. But Giordano has made his millions. Uh, he was a top defenseman in Calgary and he was paid like one. And uh, Jason Spezza, last time I checked, probably had career earnings of uh, $80, $90 million in his career. So he could play for virtually free for the Toronto Maple Leafs. Bunting's just starting. Bunting's getting his first chance at uh, at earning a big contract. How much does he already want to discount off of something that uh, he's he's worked his whole life to get to? Uh, that's that's the big question here. And, uh, and that's why you won't see a, a scenario of a, a Giordano or Spezza fall into the lap of uh, the Toronto Maple Leafs regarding bunting. Kepper, final question. we got 30 seconds. What do you hate the most about work meetings? <laughs> that I uh, get invited to them? <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Nick Kiprio, Sportsnet 590, the fan, the real Kipper and Born. It's great radio. And, and listen, check him out on YouTube as well. It's, it's, a, it's a fantastic two hours. If you're a Leaf fan, you got to check it out. Good stuff, Kipper. Have a great weekend, bud. You too, pal. Say hi to Born for me. Take care. I will.